The Cabal. War, wanted or not, is all they understand. And so he taught them. Sand eaters, scattered. Dust giants, felled. Ice reapers, buried. Siege dancers, broken. Until we grew complacent, and Gaul drove a blade between our ribs, left us gasping before the vanguard showed them that the light cannot be tamed so easily. I should have stepped forward, stamped the Red Legion into extinction. Instead, I ran the banner and watched the city's victories dull our edge once more. It should have ended before they fattened us, before they exploited us, before they forced us to lift up a murderer as our savior. Another Cabal warmonger now leads a fleet off Nessus. No more waiting. We will be there to put her in the ground. Even my people have a word for peace, but we do not use it often, or lightly. I wouldn't have summoned you if I was not sincere. Peace with the Cabal. The darkness crowds the edges of this system. The Hive serves it. You'll fall to one if not the other. My world did. Empress Keitel. I'm sorry for what you've lost. We have all suffered. I propose an alliance. Cabal don't ally. They conquer. She betrayed her father to Gaul. Don't think she won't put a gilded knife in your back too. My father was soft. He lacked ambition. As you do. Humanity won't survive unless the Commander expands his horizons. Join my Empire. You'll keep your title and gain a seat on my War Council. With my army and your light, the Cabal will crush the Hive. Then, the Black Fleet. Bow. No. Very well. Ready yourself, Commander. I'll sharpen my gilded knife and see you both on the battlefield. Listen closely, Guardian. Callus's daughter, Empress Keitel, has arrived in our system hoping to reunify the Cabal Empire. We've spotted an Imperial land tank tearing through Nessus. Ikora thinks it has something to do with Keitel's efforts. I want boots on the ground for a closer look. on site, directing from the ground. This commander was a mere legionary under Gaul's rule. He personally pulled the trigger on a horrifying amount of lightless guardians during the Red War. 
He has since risen to become a warlord among the remnants of the Red Legion, and now that Butcher carries Keitel's banner. Indy. Divide leadership on the ground long enough for our scouts to determine what Keitel is planning. And perhaps get justice for the Guardians he sent to their final deaths. Welcome aboard the Helm, Guardian, the hub for emergency logistics and maneuvers. Here you'll find the assets and information you need to complete our most time-sensitive operations. We'll continue upgrading this space as situations in the system evolve, so check in often to get the latest developments. Well done, disrupting the Cabal on Nessus. I wish that was the end of it. But unfortunately, it's just the beginning. Empress Keitel has emerged as the new face of their empire and demanded I pledge loyalty to her. Our conversation went as well as you might expect. Thanks to the information you recovered, we know this. Former members of the Red Legion and other leaderless Cabal are all competing for a seat on Keitel's War Council. In an effort to prevent Cabal reunification, I'm assembling a team to take out her aspiring commanders. Lord Saladin will act as field commander, and Osiris will report directly to me as my advisor. He's appointed a new hunter, Crow, to be your reconnaissance expert. As always, Amanda Holiday will provide air support. Your task is simple. Defeat Keitel's commanders across the Soul System. Once you eliminate their leadership, Cabal infighting will prevent Keitel from amassing real power. If we miss this opportunity, another all-out war will become inevitable. Good luck.
the new style suits you. Spoils of victory in the reef. Glint chose the materials. You haven't let me pay for any of this. If you want to repay me, keep that mask affixed to your face. It will protect you from the city's ignorance. I know what it's for. If this is what it takes to make a difference, I'm in. I've had to walk these streets under disguise more times than you know. Now I am welcome. Soon you shall be too. Patience and caution. Ah, Guardian. Saladin spoke highly of your assault. They think their tank is a show of strength, but it is no Iron Lord. Saladin will hold the line so our attention can be directed elsewhere. Names are needed. Examples. My friends in the Reef have been talking. At this point, Red Legion commanders are either brutes or braggarts. Not the type for subtlety. They want Keitel's attention. We will use that information to direct our fury. Create a power vacuum and show the Cabal the path they've chosen. Dismissed. Together in the field, huh? I'm starting to get the impression you all like having me around. Warriors of the Empire, I see your fury. For years you have waited for your leaders to reclaim you. But time has not changed your nature. Your rage becomes the swing of the cleaver, the thrust of the shield, the shout of the cannon. I send out a challenge to the remains of the broken legion. Prove your worth in battle. The ancient rites live again. The triumphant will become the first members of my war council. We are Cabal. We eat the mountains. We drink the seas. The dragon of your light roars over Nessus. Our enemies fear you, Guardian. Osiris mentioned you crashed a Cabal ritual they call the Rite of Proving. He seems to think it's not unlike our Crucible, made for settling scores. I don't see the resemblance. 
scraps of the Red Legion are competing to earn Keitel's favor. And just like her, their hands are tied by tradition. They're forced to meet every challenger or forfeit their position. We can exploit that. I want you to run down every Cabal commander you can find. If they're foolhardy enough to accept a fistfight with you, Keitel's War Council won't fill a single seat. To that end, Crow has spotted another of the Empress's hopefuls on Europa. They call him Basilius the Golem. He's looking for Golden Age relics to excavate from the ice. Basilius intends to augment his body and offer combat enhancements to other Cabal. If he succeeds, it won't be long before Keitel has an entire platoon of Exo-Legionaries at her disposal. Get in the way. research governance customs. I want to know who is in charge of the civilians. Guardian, Glint was just telling me you were on your way. All right, Guardian. The Cabal are determined to dig up something bad, and they've got the head start. They're gonna need to hustle to close the gap. If they're looking for the Deep Stone Crypt here, then they're groping around in the dark, so to speak. Sounds like there's plenty else they could find around here. Keep pushing, Guardian. This is the time, Guardian. Begin the rite of proving. That should be enough to scare them off. For a short time, anyway. Well, they seem awfully determined. Any chance they'll go looking somewhere else? Doubtful. If anything, sending the Guardian in has convinced them to return. Well, when they do, we'll be here to stop them again. You know, I'm surprised, Osiris. Once upon a time, a place like this would have set you off. Ranting and raving about Vex algorithms and prediction encoding and other stuff no one understands but you. Yes. Research is far less appealing without an assistant to confer with. Oh. Yeah, that makes sense.
Get ready to move. The Cabal have invaded the Cosmodrome. As we speak, Paul Marag leads a charge into a hive nest, seeking revenge for what Zevo Arath did to the Cabal's home system. If he succeeds, Keitel is certain to promote him to her war council, and more Cabal will flood into the Cosmodrome. We can't let that stand. Not in the territory that produces some of our best guardians. Fortunately, our enemies are distracted. Cut through the chaos and take out Mirage. If we don't crush this now, we could lose an entire generation of new lights. Eyes up. The Cabal have been holding off waves of Hive for weeks. But the situation may have deteriorated. This is an important strategic position. It allows Keitel to establish a beachhead on Earth at the Hive's expense. Letting them settle in would be a bad idea. Go forth, Guardian. Cleanse this place. would risk everything for a chance at retribution against the Hive. So much rage, so much suffering. You saw what the Hive did to the Elixir on the shore. That will push anyone to their limit. Red War proved that the Cabal have no limits. Then let's give them some. I have eyes on their commander just up ahead. Cabal honor will dictate that he'll have to answer your challenge. Time to fight fire with fire. Or bullets. Your choice. They thought that fire and force would be enough to destroy the Hive. Fools. This commander may be, but Keitel seems different. Do not confuse cunning for restraint. The moment she has the upper hand, she will attempt to make Earth the new Cabal homeworld. Maybe, maybe not. Guess we'll see. This is Amanda Holiday, reporting on my Cosmodrome flyovers. The Cabal set up shop on a bluff overlooking the moth yards. Hive's been chewing on them pretty good, but they're dug in like ticks. You know how they are. Frigates parked overhead haven't put a single round my way. Seems they're focused 110 on the Hive. One thing I haven't seen are any civilians. I don't know how big the Cabal fleet is these days, but it's gotta be spread thin. There must be a group of carriers in deep space somewhere with all their kids and old folks aboard. The whole rest of their species. Shows how much they want payback. They're risking it all on our turf, just for a piece of the hive. I know this Cabal Force looks like aggression, but I'd wager it's grief through and through. They ain't here for us. They're here for revenge. Goodness knows. 
I can relate. Did I keep you waiting? I've been busy managing the antics of your commanders. Antics? <laughs> Time-honored traditions. They don't concern you. You're auditioning members for your war council. I'd say that concerns us very much. Your commander could be a valued member of it, if he would accept my offer. You seem like a wise man. We both know that the best victory is won before the war even begins. I'm giving humanity a way out. Savala can end this now. You can end this now. A Cabal Empress with a penchant for mercy. It's a novel idea. You've learned from the mistakes of your predecessors, but I see how you lean on tradition when you fear a loss of control. I see your uncertainty, dithering. As for what I know, I know that an empress without an empire is in no position to offer anything. The Cabal have lost their home, not their honor. If we are to die, we will take many with us. Tell your commander my patience is running out. Your orders remain the same. Honor or no, without a war council, she'll have no war. 